clothing sponsor for a long time. Wow. What just happened? Shit. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, Hang on. We're back in motherfucking business. I just shit my pants because I was out there filming the start of this video and I dropped the camera and as I dropped it, you know when you sometimes try and catch something with your foot and you realise that your foot's not a hand, it's just a foot and it can't catch things so what you do is you, you basically drop kick it. Well, uh, that's what I did. Anyway, I'm going to introduce this video here so that I'm not like outside being a fucking liability again. So, I'm going to vlog the day, basically. And it's gonna be like a really day in the life. A day in the life of Joe Delaney. The late like, Cretaceous. The cutest little cottages, man. So, this is the update on the situation. Uh, I probably updated your last video or something, but currently the situation is I need a haircut and a tan. Uh, that's not my main worry though. My main worry is being living at home, you know, like God Park Avenue. Because it's a massive block. Because, like, well, there's me ma, and I don't think she's gonna take kindly to me, like, pound in the ass. <laughs> it's every oh, night in my room. A whore train. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, basically over the next couple of, or basically like the next month or so, I'm just gonna gather as much money together as I can and try and get a decent-ish pad in uh, Manchester. Tommy B might not be moving to Manchester anymore, but I might be moving in with like one of the ex on the beach lads or something, or don't know, maybe Mike. Fuck knows. I'm gonna move to Manchester anyway. Yeah, okay, game, lad. Well, let's do it then. Um, Pick me up. So today I'm gonna train twice because I went out for dinner with Mags uh, last night and I ate way too much. And I'm gonna go do some legs now. <clears throat> um, and then we just got bits of work to do and various fitness related shit. As you can see, I'm head to fucking toe in like machine fitness stuff because that happened um, I didn't have like a clothing sponsor for a long time and then I realised that I had no fucking gym clothes and I thought right I need to remedy this um, and uh, basically I, mes I messaged them saying what you're saying let me let me get on board uh, it was a tactical decision because the main reason being Obviously, I like the, the shit is legit. I'm legit actually surprised about how decent the shit is. Um, so I will be plugging a discount code, and then what I'm gonna do is gather all my ten percent and uh, put them in a fucking G wagon. So you know, this is the support Joey D's quest for a G wagon fund. You know, I'll spend that shit wisely. <clears throat> Start to go fund me. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, matching that. <laughs> uh, I agree, yeah. but. Yeah, because they've got like Rob's with them and a few of the guys are, like big YouTubers and shit, I just thought it'd be a good opportunity for like collabs and stuff when we like do expos and all that. And the shit is actually fucking good, especially this like heat tech shit. These joggers, I literally live in them. Anyway, excellent beats on tonight, so I might go. Obviously, I don't like to do a video without involving a bird at some point, so I'm gonna see what I've got on the books. I haven't really got that much in the portfolio right now, but um, I'll probably just recall something. Yeah, uh, find a Liverpool contact and go around there and watch X on the Beach and then finger the ass off something. Nah, I'm only messing. <laughs> <laughs> I might do. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go do legs. Uh, probably film a little bit, but I'm gonna train back as well later. Might got some injuries and shit these days, I'll explain that later.
I protein porridge with soya milk, sultanas, and banana uh, with a side order of classical music. Because my mum's dead sophisticated. She's not into techno. Hey. I am. Not close to me, Ed. Fucking. Close this is me. two times Del Bros uh, heading out to Starbucks because. Better I can't really, in the house. Yeah, I can't really work at home with like me ma pottering about and that and just doing like mum tasks around the yeah, house. Yeah, and, and like your like, dad telling you what he's bought when uh, he's been shopping and that. It's wank, man. It's proper. So, yeah, I'm gonna go Spend Starbucks a quid, for a few else. hours, get a little coffee. <laughs> And <laughs> that exaggerated sneezes, there's no need. Whoa, that wasn't, that was real. That was exaggerated. That was fucking real, fuck mate. Okay, so I'm gonna, first thing is I got some emails to get to, and then I'm gonna edit this vlog, to, uh, not vlog, this uh, Q&A Q &A together, and what happens is I always end up with about fucking, like an hour or over an hour's worth of footage, because I have like fucking hundreds of questions, uh, and then I just, Sit there and just chop out the shit ones, basically. Um, that was a wank attempt at parking. Okay. And that is it, okay. So we're gonna go start and do some shit. Just done video editing. Uh, Q&A's okay. exporting. Uh, we're gonna get off and eat something and then go to the gym. Hiya. I'm the hype. This is meal two. There's absolutely no method to it whatsoever. Basically, I just opened the fridge and found sun dried tomatoes and mushrooms and started to throw them in an omelette. So, I'm gonna eat this, let it go down, and then go and do back. Yeah, also, my mum's playing the flute still. So, if anyone wants to scout her for their orchestra, just get her involved. Yeah, take her away. Fuck. <laughs> goes and everything. <laughs> That's that. Everything. Also, carrots are good. Well, I'll start sending out some blanket text messages to birds and see if I can find somewhere to uh, watch out on the beach tonight. Saying about my omelette folding skills. <laughs> So I did warn you this was a fitness video. So I did get sent some soups. I'm not really a big soup kind of person, but there are a few things that I use, like the protein points that I had before was there's some protein over there. Company's called Rich Protein or something. Rich protein? Rich something. Uh, creatine is just creatine. Everyone should take it pretty much all the fucking time if you're training. Uh, I got some pre-workout for a change just for like nostalgic feels. So shout out to them for hooking me up. Let's see what it fucking tastes like. I don't know. I haven't tasted it. I haven't opened it, but I haven't tasted it. I just smelled it. So, because that's all I really give a shit, man. Let's face it. A pre-workout. You're just, just, do this you're do just it. getting tingles, aren't you? Yeah. And like a bit of creatine that doesn't really matter because you're just getting tingles and the feeling that you're gonna make it. You just for you know, a bit. You're just doing it for the to be a fucking gym bro, aren't you? It's like buying a lottery it's ticket. Fucking sound, man. Okay. That wine. Pre-wine. Tastes alright mate, it's decent. <sighs> decent. Okay, again, yeah. Cheers fellas for hooking Joey deal. Doing a bit. Right, I'm gonna show you my playlist. Cause everyone's like, hey Joe, show me your fucking playlist. So, this is like, uh, I'll just scroll down real quick and um, you can just like pause the video and shit if you want. So let me, hang on, one sec. So, there you go. Okay, here's Mike. 
Get all them tunes, kids. Okay. Right, more coming up later. Okay. This is a bedroom acrobatics volume two. Volume one was like vlog eleven or something. This bird's now got brown hair, but she used to be blonde and fitter, but <laughs> she's not as tidy anymore. So whatever. Still good at like bedroom acrobatics. So I've gone to it. They're gonna nail this shit, man. Cat shit. <laughs> 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 Alright, let's see what happens. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I'm fucking strong here. Hey, I'm a cheerleader. I'm yes, really yeah. okay. <laughs> 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 right, I want to get you on one, on one hand, man. One hand. Yeah. Uh, right. I hope we nailed that. Right, right. Yeah. Yeah. Is that right? No. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Let me try some new bands. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna get up. I'm gonna sit on your bed. Push up. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, is he? Uh, I'm sick of this. Nah, no, not that bad. Watch me now. To the side. <laughs> Dream workout. Uh, all you require is one hoe. <laughs> Absolutely no dumbbells. Just one, just one little rat. <laughs> okay, we're gonna uh, watch that ass. I mean, me on TV. Oh, what are you doing, you? Uh uh. I'm trying to find the other button. Yeah, okay, just hurry up. Just trying to film the TV here. That no, ass is in the way. Sorry. Ah, oh, yeah. Back here. Okay. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's watch Joey D on TV. Same about that. Same about that. Good pick, that, innit? Yeah. Show us. Decent, mate. Send me that shit. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, so apparently, either she's a shit host <laughs> or I'm a shit bang because I'm getting pancake mixed up a fucking tub, man. Oh my god. That's like, that's like even below bronze package <laughs> shit, man. <laughs> no, that's in pancakes are crap, so. Look you. This is my worth. This is what I'm worth. Not a fucking lot, man. People, what's happening? Okay, I got the uh, camera balanced in the corner and hopefully it's gonna stay there, but uh, I'm gonna wrap up this vlog, obviously, because this is supposed to be a day vlog and now it's the next fucking day. But um, there was some stuff that I forgot to uh, mention. Um, I mentioned about injuries. I had an adductor injury, which kept me off squatting for a few weeks. Uh, I feel like that's better now, but my squat has obviously suffered just a little bit. Um, that's why I was only doing like 100K when during that workout in the morning. Um, I have a chest injury that's stopped me from training chest since uh, last time I trained chest was in um, Australia actually and I've even not been able to train like a couple of other, like, other body parts that well um, just because sometimes the movement is still not quite right but I feel like it won't be long, it'll probably just be a, like a few days or maybe a week now and then I'll be back to it but I have been in a surplus um, since I am bulking now and so I feel like it's better to be in a surplus when you are injured, do you know what I mean? It's like, uh, I don't know, I feel like being in a deficit is not really productive when you're injured to be honest because if there's ever going to be a time when you're losing gains it's when you're in a deficit and obviously if you can't train a body part at the same time then that's just a, yeah, it's just a recipe for disaster. Macros right now, I'm going pretty low protein, I'm just under uh, a gram per pound, um, or there or thereabouts, fat fairly low as well, I'm going to do quite high carb for this bullet because I haven't really done that so like thus far in my lifting career, I've always been doing, um, I don't want to this, I've always been doing, um, I'd say I'm well more attractive with them on, I've always been doing like high-ish protein, and carbs have always just been like moderate, but uh, I'm gonna go quite high carb. And also, I'm gonna kind of um, get a lot of my protein from more nutrient dense sources like lentils and beans and pulses and generally like that kind of shit. Um, obviously, I'm not going vegan, but uh, I feel like if I make up a lot of my protein from that kind of stuff, I'll just have. I'll be getting a lot more micros in than if I make up all my protein out of fucking chicken breast, which is pretty lacking uh, in nutrients, really, compared to some of that, those things. That's it, man. I'm just going to bulk like a motherfucker, man. I felt real good yesterday, especially during that back workout. Uh, I'm going to try and stay lean. Cal's, I'm going to be bulking on maybe like 3-1 to start off with or something. And I think if I'm training, that's not really much of a surplus at all for me because I feel like my maintenance is probably around the high 2000s these days uh, so what else just gonna bulk into I think it's like it's not even that far away from body power obviously since I don't compete body power is a good uh, time for me to kind of aim for to aim to be in shape because obviously well you're walking around in a fucking some exhibition with a load of dudes with the nips out and what better time uh, so that's it I'm gonna aim to come in pretty decent for them I'm gonna leave it quite late to cut because I feel like if I stay on track with a cut I can do it not fast because obviously you're gonna be losing gains if you're cutting too fast but you know I feel like I won't get so fat that I need a proper full length cut I, I feel like I'll just do like maybe a seven or six week cut perhaps um, and hopefully that'll do me because I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be gaining much fat at all. So yeah, uh, that's it. I'm drinking coffee. This was a fitness video. Over and motherfucking out. Jordy Lenny is my hero.